How do we haul a dinosaur from one place to the next? The Imaginex Dinosaur Hauler. This truck is massive. I'm so happy to have so many awesome new dino toys. This is the biggest set I have opened so far, and I'm super excited to do it. See, there's a cage, it comes out. There is a new dinosaur, I don't think we've seen that one yet. And there's a net to capture them, and a really cool army figure. Now let's look at that thing. Do you see the dino hiding in the cage? Beautiful truck. Oh, it's nice. Great colors. This also is available in a gift set. The truck is blue. There are some other dinosaurs from the baby dinosaur line. More of these dinosaurs in the package. Some of them are in different colors. I'll probably get that set too. Probably. Just because I want all the different dinosaurs I can get. This is the action feature. You can try it now. I mean... It's this awesome bridge. I think it also ejects this. We'll check that out after I open the box. It says turn power pad, and then it says, uh-oh. <laughs> Does it say uh-oh? Yes, it looks like there's been a dinosaur spill, but it's okay because you can press the launch and look out blue. I guess blue is a common character. I haven't seen the Jurassic World movies yet. I'm gonna get on that. I see that one is on Netflix, so. There's a lot of cool things in this set. Well, the wheels are the same. They always have these like really loose axled wheels. The, the truck really bounces around. I guess that helps it take any terrain. I wonder if I can drive this thing up. Totally can drive the little ATV up if I wanted to. Doesn't come with that. I have to get that poor little dino out of there. He's really tied up in there. Like dino scissors. Ah. Whoa. Whoa. Don't worry, I'll show you soon. They're incorporating lots of different things that they usually don't in these sets. Oh, <laughs> oh it's a double action. Can like put down the ramp and that's fine. There's an extra step. Oh, that's so cool. Here's something that we don't see very often, a double seater on this thing. It's because it's so big. Like here's the size of a normal Jeep that we get, but look how big this truck is. It's massive. And again, it shakes on its axles. This also shakes on its axles like that. The wheels are just, like, loose. I love that it's not painted. I know people like painted things, but when you use the different colors of plastic to emphasize the different parts of the truck, I just think that they all pop, and it just looks so good. It's a beauty. Oh, it's a nice truck. I don't like to get large toys because they do take up a lot of space. I'm really glad I got this. Think of all the dinosaurs you can store in here. Look, there's a little trap door. <laughs> That's just dangerous. Poor guy, whoever falls in there with the dinosaurs. And this is on wheels, so that's why that it escapes so well. And then there's a, this thing, which we've seen some of these in some of the other play sets. So yeah, we'll be able to mix and match other different parts so there's another gun that has the same ball joint that fits into this part. But this is the piece that came with it. And it attaches to this awesome real net. And what a great way to capture the dino that you have just accidentally let go. So yeah, the soldier can go up to the top and he can hold on to the gun. Maybe he can hold on to the gun. He's of a different mold. I'm gonna show you that later. His hands don't work as well. Oh, there, I got him. I managed to get it snapped into place. And then you have your dinosaur. I don't usually show the features first, but here we go. And then you can just shoot it over the dinosaur and look, you caught him in the net. 
All of these features are working so well for me today. Let's take this opportunity to look at this Blue Raptor and all of his articulation and wonderment. He has two posable arms that have pretty good range of motion, and he has legs that go back that far, forward this far. He's got his Jurassic World tattoo on the bottom of his foot. He's got an articulated tail that has a pretty good range of motion too, tucked under that much. It can stick up in the air that much. His jaw has articulation. Oh, but by using the top of his head. And he has the new magic eyes that follow you no matter where you go, which is great. And that is on all of the new design dinosaurs for these sets. So cool. He was a new dinosaur specific to this set. I've opened up all of the smaller sets. At the end of this video, I will show you all of the dinosaurs. There's two giant playset ones, but I'll show you all of the smaller ones that come in the playsets that aren't gimmick dinosaurs. I showed you the truck, but I'm seeing more details. These ladders are cool that you can climb up on. Oh, how does the truck look like that? It looks pretty good like that too. Great looking truck. This works great. This cage you can play with on your own. You can fill it with dinosaurs. Imagine the fun that you can have with this trap door. You accidentally stand on this and it gives way and you're down in there. So good. Look at the detail on that. I noticed that this is harder to open might be because of my bigger fingers. I guess you could push it from the inside if you're having trouble opening it with just that fastener. It's a really nice cage. I have all these dinosaurs and I got the soldier inside. This bright colored missile gun, which is sweet with this ball joint. You could put this on the front of the truck as well. That connection is really cool. Apparently that's an old joint. I just never have opened any toys that have this with it. I love its range of motion. I have to try with the double seat inside. But first, take a look at this character. They've really made these stylized more recently. And it's funny because he's a soldier, but he definitely has thinner arms than your normal Imagine X figure. Let me show you one of the ones from the other set. This is a classic Imagine X figure. I guess it's just the shoulders they've managed to make smaller. They gave him a broader chest though. Imagine X figures have come quite far. I really do prefer all of the character and details that they put into these new ones. He looks good. Putting them side by side, it's clear to me which one I like better. Let's put both of these guys in the truck and see how that works out. There's little handles for them to hold on to so they can take bumpy rides and still stay in securely. Even though I am having a hard time making the handle actually function. I don't know how well either of them are fitting in. But they do fit in and I'm shaking it around. They're staying in their seats. So that looks good. I love that two people can fit in here. So great. Look at them driving around in their automobile. That's even cool where they put the screws in. That looks like a nice shiny detail. Works well on a truck like this. Close up the cage, pop it back into place, put everything back into place. Put the net in here. I don't know if they're going to be able to see with that net hanging down there. Can you believe it? They've even put details on the bottom. Isn't that amazing? It rolls real smoothly. I bet the Raptor can ride in the front seat too. Let's check out that feature one more time. Ah, oh, it's so cool. I'm gonna pop this monster back in here. Let's put him in backwards. Roll that back up. Let's see if the Jeep can drive up here. Yep, totally the Jeep can go for a ride. You can take the Jeep to fix it up now that the dinosaurs have taken over the park. It doesn't fit like that. It would only fit going forward because the front of the truck is smaller. That's cool. I like that. Imaginix is really good about making their sets play nicely together. Do you like this truck? What's your favorite feature on it? It's a beauty. 
All right, at the end of this video, I'm going to show you all of the dinosaurs that I've gotten so far in the Imaginex series. I hope you'll check out all of the other Imaginex Jurassic World reviews that I've done. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe. We'll see you next time. The Imaginex Dinosaur Holler. All right, let's look at these dinosaurs from biggest to smallest. There's Dasher and Dancer and Prancer and Vixen. I don't think that's their names. There's this guy. <laughs> so cool. This guy. <laughs> Very cool. This guy. <laughs> Very cute. This guy. <laughs> Awesomeness, aquatic awesomeness. This guy, oh yeah. Gonna have to check out my other reviews to see where these dinosaurs come from. There's this guy, oh yeah, oh yeah. And another kind of raptor. And there's this one, nice. And then there's the pterodactyl. Oh, yeah. He flies. Let's put him over here because he's green. And then there's all the baby ones that come in the single sets. Do check out the video and get a closer look at them. Baby T-Rex. This guy. There's the blue and the orange raptor. And there's these compies. Those are bad little guys. Ugh. Hug your dinosaurs!